Now, here's Chief Meteorologist Tony Petrarca with your live Pinpoint Doppler 12 Futurecast. And the back edge of at least the steady rain now passing through southeastern Massachusetts. We go to live pinpoint Doppler 12 radar. You can see that solid area of green. And this is light to at times moderate rain. The flecks of yellow indicating actually some heavier downpours. The blue line is the back edge now passing uh, through New Bedford. This will be heading offshore over the next couple of hours. Behind that, it's still damp, but notice the absence of any significant rain. So this will be winding down shortly. Downtown Providence, cloudy, cool, and damp. Certainly not cold, and fortunately, uh, well above freezing here, so no icing situation. Temperature at 40. The wind is calm, and the humidity is high, and usually these two ingredients can sometimes lead to fog. You have a lot of moisture floating in the air along with light wind. So later tonight, a little bit of patchy fog is possible. Gray skies across the region, upper 30s to low 40s along the south shore, westerly at 42. Even some of the normally coldest spots, northern suburbs like Smithfield and out towards Foster Gloucester in the upper 30s as well, Worcester at 36 degrees. Small compact weather system, little weather disturbance passing through right now. The closest snow in upstate New York and northern New England, this will be sliding offshore. Underneath it, you see some breaks in the clouds and we'll eventually we'll get into some very warm summer sunshine for tomorrow. We're not talking 70s, but well into the 50s tomorrow afternoon. So what's left of some of these showers across southeastern Mass will pull away overnight. Tomorrow morning, this is around 8 o'clock, any early morning clouds or fog thinning out to at least partly sunny skies. Temperatures starting off in the 40s and then during the afternoon, it's a blend of both clouds and sunshine. This is 2 o'clock and then by tomorrow evening still looking at mild, dry, and comfortable weather. So overnight tonight, the temperature eventually slipping down to the uh, mid and upper 30s of uh, the rain ending across southeastern Massachusetts. Any leftover clouds early in the morning giving way to at least partly sunny skies and a very warm start. Well, for this time of year and this time of day, 42 early in the morning, 50 by late morning, having no problem getting well into the 50s tomorrow afternoon. 54 to 57 degrees, sunshine and some fair weather clouds. It'll be breezy, mild and dry. So a little hint of spring here, unusual for this time of year. Many locations in the mid 50s tomorrow with a gusty west breeze. That is a dry and, and normally a mild wind direction, 15 to 25 miles per hour. Sunshine mid 50s in our northern suburbs and looking good across southeastern Mass though. Coastal communities and parts of Buzzers Bay and the Cape will be slightly cooler, but all around a nice, almost early spring-like day. Seven-day future cast, next couple of chances for rain, mostly at night. That would dry tomorrow day, late tomorrow night some rain showers. Dries out Thursday day, and then late Thursday night, Friday morning some rain showers. New information now suggesting that the showers on Friday morning would be just that, morning only, drying out Friday afternoon, setting up for a windy, blustery, and cooler weekend, Saturday and Sunday, not as warm, but with sunshine, very windy, 47 on Saturday and 41 degrees on Sunday. You can download the brand new Channel 12 app on the iPad. It is absolutely free. But the next three afternoons, 50 degrees or higher. I like it. Yeah.